Guys, what's up? Ty Host here, and today I would actually like to show you everybody um, the top 10 things to get from Cydia when you are jailbroken. Now, some of these things are must haves, and the other things are just things to get if you would like them. Now, must I'm going to start out with the um, five must haves to get. Now, all these things are not going to be rated for my favorite. I'm just going to be showing you the top 10 things that I do believe that you should get. Now, the two that, I, that are on my dock that I definitely recommend you guys get is Winterboard and Installus. Now, there's been a lot of um, things about Winterboard saying that it takes up a lot of memory and stuff like that. But, <clears throat> what Winterboard actually allows you to do is customize your um, thing. Now, I'm not going to go through all the trouble to put a theme on and respring, but I will show you some screenshots and what it allows you to do, which I'm pretty sure everybody knows what it is. And I think I do have some screenshots and my photos here on that. Um, here's a theme right here. The glass color theme, and as you see, it's got like, custom icons and stuff like that. So that's uh, Winterboard there, and you can download themes from Cydia. And the next one that's in my dock is called Installus. Now, Installus allows you to crack applications and get free apps from the App Store. Like, for instance, <coughs> Ira Pro is a... No, I wanted to use search IVIP Black. Now this is a thousand dollar app that's in the App Store, and you can get this for free just from searching it. And um, here, now you just scroll down and a couple. Of, there it is, IVIP Black. So um, just click on it and download it and install it, whatever. So that's the first two things that I want to show you for must-haves. Next must-have is going to be called the iFile. iFile is a little file manager to put on your phone and it's actually a paid city thing but if you'd rather not buy it <clears throat> you can just add a source and get it for free now it's just a little file manager you can look at all your things applications and things like that to that like here's all my apps you can delete apps from here if you would like it does not matter um so that's another one called iFile and now the next one that I do recommend you get from Cydia is called SB Settings. It's, it's SB stands for Springboards and Settings. So once you install this from Cydia, you just swipe your finger across the top and you get this. Now I have a theme on mine. Yours will not look like that, but I'll take it off to show you. Um, I'm just going to put on the default one. And let it respring here. Alright, so here we are. Let's slide to unlock it. And that's what you'll see for SB settings. You can turn on your Wi Fi, SSH. If you have open SSH, your 3D network, airplane mode, Bluetooth, and all much more things. So that's SB settings, and that was like the number four must have from Cydia. Now the next must have from Cydia is going to be in your settings. Where is it here? Page 2D. Oh, I'm sorry guys, Page 2D is actually a paid um, Cydia thing. I don't believe there's any repo to crack it or anything. But if there is good, then you can download it that way. But obviously you can see I have page dots down there. And I have vertical and horizontally scrolling. So I can scroll back and vertical. So that's Page 2D guys. And you can pick this up from Cydia for $1.99. Unless you find a repo to crack it. So now let's just get on with the next five things to get, have when you're jailbroken. These are not must-haves. These are the things that I do believe that you should get. Now, camera wallpaper is definitely one of them. So let's you to do is have camera wallpaper. My camera is my wallpaper. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And uh, you can just configure the settings in the settings application. And you can just turn it off and that's back to normal. So that's called camera wallpaper. Now the next thing to have if you would like is called iSocial Share. As you see I have it here. Now um, what this actually allows you to do if you actually go, if you have photos here. So we'll actually go into photos. 
and say you want it to like import a photo like you say I want to import this photo to my Facebook I just hit this little top button up here and now it gives me instead of log out and cancel it just gives me Facebook and Twitter so I can just go ahead and click Facebook and log in and import the picture you can get that for $1.99 in city as well unless you have a report of crack it and that's called I social share everything will be in the description below that I mentioned and um, alright so let's get on with the next thing um, the next one is actually going to be called um, SB Rotator. Now I have this disabled. So obviously what this allows you to do is just rotate your springboard. Now I know the iPad can do this without being jailbroken but this is new for the iPhone and iPod. Because we are not allowed to do this. So now I do recommend you install this and this is pretty cool if you like to rotate your um, springboard the other thing that I found pretty cool was that you can rotate your lock screen so um, if you want this you can just go ahead and go into uh, Cydia and search LS rotator and SB rotator see LS rotator and SB rotator wherever SB is right here I'm just gonna go ahead and disable that and now the last thing I do recommend you guys get is Safari Download Manager. Now what this uh, you need iFile that I mentioned before in the video to use this, but all you can do is you can actually go to like um, show you this Safari. Search the web. And you can actually download things now. It actually gives you this little tab that you downloaded stuff. Um, let's say like want to download like all right you all know green boys and their website here so i'll just show you that real quick that you can actually download that this ain't gonna work so obviously i'm on an iphone so and just click windows real quick and then it gives you a tab to download so we go ahead and click download and now it's actually downloading before it wouldn't allow you to actually do this now you click on it open an iFile that's why you're gonna need iFile so guys that was my top 10 things to get from City once you were jailbroken. So thanks for watching. Um, comment, or subscribe, and tell me what your top 10 things are, or even one thing. That'd be great. So peace out, guys.